Today we're going to talk about a very interesting Blender add-on called Matplus. Matplus is a new Blender add-on that basically brings a Substance Painter-like style of texturing directly into Blender. I mean, in simple terms, it turns Blender's Material Editor into a layer-based painting tool. As a result, you will have familiar features like layers, masks, and blending modes fully integrated into your scene without needing any external software. And the good thing is that Matplus draws inspiration from professional tools like I said, Substance Painter, Armor Paint, and even Mari, but it runs entirely in Blender. So for anyone who's been wishing for a built-in, high-end texture and experience in Blender, this add-on might be your savior. And by the way, the add-on is from the developers of popular add-ons such as RBD Lab, so you know the quality is good. Where do we start? At the core, Matplus is a fully non-destructive paint layer system, as you already know, which lets you stack and tweak material layers just like substance. You can create multiple layers or paint or detail and adjust each with blending modes to have that fine control over how layers combine. And each layer has its own mask for precise editing, so you can paint or reveal details exactly what you want them to be. The add-on also supports real-time effects such as blur, high-pass filters, level adjustments, and more than that, which you can apply on the layers non-destructively. This means if you want to soften a paint layer or add some noise or detail, you can do it on the fly and tweak it later. Interestingly enough, Matplus even includes 2D symmetry painting, which allows you to paint over the flat UV layout with symmetry, similar to what you will find in Substance Painter's 2D view, beyond the layer painting itself. The add-on brings a bunch of extra features that really round out the texturing workflow. For example, it has an advanced baking system built in, which can bake maps like normals, ambient occlusion, curvature, edgeware, bevel maps, and so on. Essentially all those supporting textures you would typically generate in a PBR workflow. Matplus also supports multiple UDIMs, so you can work on high detail models spread across many texture tiles, and once your material painting is done, the add-on makes it easy to export game-ready texture maps for engines such as Unreal, Unity, and so on on the go, with base color, roughness, normal maps, etc., which are going to be ready to plug into your game engine and work on your game project. And one huge bonus that sets Matplus apart is the content which it has included with it, so you will get over 240 grayscale textures, including noise patterns, grunge maps, etc., to use as masks and over 360 ready-made PBR materials that help you start working right away on your projects. So you will get a library of high-quality hard surface textures in addition to a variety of custom brushes for painting. And having this big library of materials and masks out of the box, you mean you can start texturing with a rich toolkit immediately, just like you would do in Substance, instead of having to source or recreate everything from scratch. So as you can see, it is a really interesting package, basically helping you to start working right away. And what really stands out with Matplus compared to other material tools out there is that first of all, as a Blender user, you don't have to leave the software while having very interesting texturing capabilities, which makes it appealing for artists and studios on a budget. In addition to this, you will have the texturing and painting tools and features in addition to the library that we talked about, which is a two-in-one kind of deal because in Blender, you will either find add-ons for texturing or add-ons for libraries. And with this one, you're getting both. So the huge library of materials and masks is gonna be a really interesting bonus because you're essentially equipped with hundreds of textures and ready-made materials from the start, which is far more content that you will find out there. Also, advanced features like real-time layer effects and anchor-like mask linking system show that this add-on is aiming to rival the depth of Substance Painter's workflow, and hopefully over time with future updates, it will become even better. And even the bacon and export tools are integrated seamlessly, which is gonna help you bake different maps on the fly. Also, interesting thing you will notice right away is the ease of use when it comes to the user interface and user experience in this add-on, because it is designed to look intuitive. So, if you are interested in this add-on, you will find all the necessary links in the description. I hope you guys found this video useful and informative. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Also, please subscribe to the channel to receive more videos like this. 
Thank you guys very much for watching, and I will see you in the next one.